The question is as follows. To ask Her Majesty's Government how they intend to police and enforce the new regulations for UK inshore fishing waters. My Lords, the UK has a robust enforcement system delivered by the Marine Management Organisation, MMO, and Inshore Fisheries and Conservation Authorities, IFCAs in England. The MMO cover the UK's exclusive economic zone from six nautical miles to 200 nautical miles, or the median line whilst IFCAs cover the area from zero to six nautical miles. As we leave the EU, we will need to review and reflect on the level of fisheries enforcement required. Lords, I thank the noble Lord, the Minister, for his answer. I have to say this simple sailor is, is absolutely uh, stunned by the answer, which shows amazing complacency. Um, the bottom line is we have very, very few vessels involved in this. Um, they are not properly centrally coordinated. The, the, we've already seen a number of the countries involved saying, well, to hell with what you're saying, we're coming there anyway. We will be made a laughing stock if we apply some rules and cannot enforce them. I'd like to ask the Noble Lord, the Minister, will we now establish a centralised command system to actually control the various assets we have, far too few of them, to be able to focus on things like someone fishing illegally in the 6 to 12 mile zone? Uh, and will we also ensure that we build some more ships and boats to ensure we can actually enforce it? My Lords, I, I think the best thing is I'd like to do is because I want to go as well, is if the Noble Law would be prepared to go with me to Newcastle to see the vessel monitoring system, which I've learned a great deal about since his question was on the order paper, which is a digital service which enables us to target those, uh, the, the, those areas so that we know every vessel that's at sea within our waters and therefore, and I've got some very interesting statistics as to the enforcement statistics by the Royal Navy and others, but in addition to that, my Lords, not only are the three vessels the offshore patrol vessels, there are a further five which are new river offshore patrol vessels, five are currently in build, and they will also be used, amongst other things, for fisheries protection. But as I've said earlier, we will need to review all that we need to ensure we have fisheries protection.